Hello everyone, today we're going to learn how to use City Mail and how to log in using your college email. So the first thing that you are going to do is go to www.citymail.ccny.cuny.edu to log in and find your email or to activate an account. If it's your first time using the City Mail, you must first activate your account, clicking the link that says Account Activation, CCNY. Option A would be if you need to activate your email account, forgot your password, or you need to reset it, or if you want to just simply look up your Emple ID or your email address. Option B is if you already know your password, but you would like to change it, or you want to test your password out. You can also use this link. Your username will consist of the first initial of your first name, plus up to six characters of your last name plus a two or three digit numerical value followed by your campus domain name. And this is an example, jdoe 000 at citymail.cuny.edu. This would always be your credentials right here. When you activate this account, you will have access to Office 365 online and you can download them on your mobile device as well. If you have a tablet, if you have a phone, and even on your computer, you do have access to download all of these resources on your phone. It is recommended that you do add it to your tablet or your computer, definitely on your computer because you can use OneDrive, you can use Word to write your papers, you can use Excel for many classes, PowerPoints in case you have a presentation or a group project, and class notebooks, these are all things that you need to use throughout your college career. Another thing I would like to mention is that downloading it on your phone is recommended, especially Outlook, because it would allow you to receive any emails from school. You need to check your emails recommended at least twice a day So after you put on the search bar, the link shown in the PowerPoint, which is citymail.cuny.cuny.edu, it will take you to the main page. In here, this is where you're going to click account Activ activation. And here's where you're gonna get your option A or option B. If you need to activate your account, you need to automatically click option A. And this is what the first page looks like. You're going to have to put your last name, the last four digits of your social security number, and your date of birth. There's four steps to this, so just make sure you do that. And at the end, you will receive all your credentials. After completing all of that, you can definitely go back to the page and click on City Mail Login. And this is where it's going to take you. You have Outlook, OneDrive, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, Teams, and many others. You can install Office onto your computer. But what we want to do is definitely check our emails. Your email is going to be your best friend throughout your whole college career because here's where you're gonna get all official communications all official communications happens via city mail. You will get important emails from the president of the City College of New York. You will get important emails from Blackboard, just many reminders, just in case you do not have the Blackboard app. You will get some reminders here on your email automatically. Some professors communicate to your Outlook email that the school provides to you, and you get many emails either from your department, it goes straight to this email, and also your CUNY First Alerts, any Student Life Counseling Center, and many, many other resources. They're all going to go to your Outlook, not your personal email. So make sure you have this app definitely on your phone and have the notifications on so you are alert every time something is going on at campus. If school closes down because of snow days, 
this is where you will get your alerts if you don't have them already set up through text message but all official emails from the college are going to go to your outlook so make sure you have this on all your devices and notifications on on the phone because you do need to check this at least twice a day just to make sure that you don't miss any important information Another important thing about having your city mail login information, all of those credentials, is that when you're on campus, you will need this to put internet on your phone just to access Wi-Fi. It's going to be the first part of your email and the password that you have set up for this email. All of this is going to go automatically on your login for the Wi-Fi to, in campus. So you will need this. It's going to be um, beneficial on your computer when you take your device to school or any other device or even on your phone just so you can have the Wi-Fi. These are the credentials that you will need in order to have access to the school Wi-Fi. So that is all for CityMail and how to log in using your college email. Good luck.